Hey Star Wars fans, thanks for tuning in to another video. Got a bit of an action figure review today, a little bit different. We're going flashback again like I did with the Pod Racer a couple of weeks ago. We're sticking with the Phantom Menace and uh, we're looking at the Cardu with Jar Jar Binks. Uh, this is a cool set, I got this really cheap on eBay. Uh, the box is a little beat up, I've already got the figure on the shelf. I'll be getting it off for review. So uh, yeah, I've got a bit, on a bit of an episode one nostalgia kick at the moment. So pretty excited to uh, get some of these older toys that I never got as a kid. I uh, was only like 11 when Phantom Menace came out, so it's awesome to get this stuff now. And uh, I'm really, really happy with this one. So let's let's go and have a look. All right, guys, here it is. The video you've been waiting for is Cardu and Jar Jar Binks. What a fantastic set. I love this thing so much. I would have, I would have loved to have had this as a kid. Um, <laughs> this just cracks me up. I just love the look on Jar Jar's face. So we'll uh, get a look at the figure that is sitting precariously. Hey, it's like what happened in the movie. <laughs> so I do just have a bit of a blue tack on his bottom there. It's not um, Gungan Muck. So we do get a uh, interesting looking Jar Jar figure here. Definitely not the best. Judge our finger in the world, but it's uh gets the job done. There we go. Still alright. Does come with the uh, boomer holder thing, which you can stick in his hand, it's a bit loose. Um, yeah, it doesn't want to hold in there very well. But that's okay, I like having him holding the Cardu with two hands. Uh, you probably get it around that thick part there if you wanted to. Um, but yeah, his articulation's pretty limited. That's sort of the swivel in the neck there. Elbows, that sort of funky wrist. And then, the, yeah, the legs are very much sort of sculpted and posed so that he's uh, sitting. He does have peg holes on the bottom though. Not too bad. And here we have the Cardu. Let's get a look at him. Again, I'll get that blue tack off there. So the uh, little gimmick with this one is he's got a little backpack there. As you can see, there is a little mechanism. And his sort of head bobs up and down as well. He's got this sort of rope for the... Um, So you could have him, have him leading out ahead. <laughs> it's just too much fun, too much fun. Um, unfortunately, the static position of the toy is with his sort of legs open like that. Um, it will stand. Uh, it does want to just sort of spring open a little bit. Yeah, it will. It will stand like that. So. It's not too bad. Um, what I actually did is I took one of my spare stands that I have here and I found a drill bit that was just a tiny little bit smaller than the uh, than the actual peg there. And I drilled two really small holes into the bottom of the feet so that I could just put them on the, the pegs of the stand nice and snug. Um, I went smaller with the drill bit just because, you know, as you sort of wiggle the drill a little bit, it will get a little bit bigger. Um, and that gives him a nice tight fit, so it does sit on the stand. You don't have to worry about him moving around too much. And that sort of stays static. I was going to pull it apart and uh, take the sort of mechanism out there, but there's no screws. Um, and it would be a case of breaking the plastic open and doing all that sort of stuff. So I'm not going to worry. It looks cool like it is. I get to make him run around the yard <laughs> or the house, whatever it may be. So let's get um, Mr. Jar Jar back up on the saddle. So I know he's meant to, meant to hold the string. But the string's a bit long. So I've just sort of been wrapping it over there. Putting his hands on the handle. 
It's a little bit fiddly, but it's all right. There we go. With another look at some cool Phantom Menace toys back from the 90s. It was a good time. <laughs> this is a good toy. I like this a lot. Do, 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 do. Let's make him run across the camera again. It's fun. You know it. Be jealous. Go out and buy yourself a Cardu. I've seen a few people get them now. I just love the design of the thing. Like I love the sort of skin tones and the sculpting. He's very dinosaur-like. I like the face. He's got like a bit of a duck beak. A two-legged duck horse. His feet. Seriously, I wish Hasbro would still put stuff out like this. Don't care if it's got the gimmicks. Just put them out. Love some cool little beast sets like this. It's been a long time. Anyway, guys, let me know what you think in the comments below. Please give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you have yet to subscribe to my channel, please do. I'd be very much appreciative. And there's uh, always cool content like this. I just did the pod racer, Anakin's pod racer, a few weeks back. And uh, yeah, plenty of plenty more stuff on the way. So stay tuned. Thank you very much for watching. Until my next video, may the force be with you. We're a little rushed, so if you'll just get on board, we'll get out of here.